Scientists are actively testing human race right here in the valley looking for the monkeypox pathogen. They believe they will find it, but for now, there are no confirmed cases of the virus here in Nevada. According to the CDC, the number of confirmed or probable cases of monkeypox has grown to 31 here in the U.S. And officials just reported 25 confirmed cases this past Friday. Anchor Abel Garcia spoke with local health experts about the search for monkeypox here in the valley. For more than two and a half years, scientists have been using samples from our wastewater to identify infectious diseases here in Las Vegas. Now they're taking a closer look at these samples to see if monkeypox has made its way to the valley. Another virus is sweeping the country. The CDC now reporting that 12 states have cases of monkeypox. Scientists here in Southern Nevada are trying to stay one step ahead. Don't have to wait until we start seeing people line up at the, the test sites for that to happen. We can actually see it in the wastewater and know that it's going to start spreading in the community. Southern Nevada Water Authority's principal research microbiologist, Dr. Daniel Garrity, says our wastewater is a terrific detector of viruses like monkeypox before clinical cases appear in the valley. These same tests have been used to identify different strains of COVID-19. Instead of having tens of thousands of people go wait in line and get tested, we can do that with one sample at each of these facilities around town. California has one of the highest numbers of monkeypox cases in the country right now. This infectious disease specialist at UNLV, Dr. David DeJohn, says the illness begins with headaches, muscle aches, chills, and lesions. The rash, which has this sort of uh, appearance of these lesions that can be uh, rather large, they can be pustular, um, they can appear really anywhere on the body. Dr. DeJohn says monkeypox is not airborne, but you can catch it from an infected animal or human through direct contact with bodily fluids, sores, or infected materials. Nowhere near as contagious as the SARS coronavirus, which is airborne, so you know, really spread through the air and respiratory droplets. This is not spread that way. While there have been no confirmed cases of monkeypox in the valley, Dr. Edwin O, the scientist leading the wastewater testing at UNLV, says they are being vigilant. This is the real value of wastewater surveillance, gives us that unbiased look at what's happening in the community. A vaccine to prevent monkeypox is available, and the Southern Nevada Health District says they will order it from the CDC if it's needed. Health officials say if you continue to experience any symptoms, to contact your primary care or doctor as soon as possible. I'm Abel Garcia reporting from Spring Valley.